intraosseous cannulation is done for emergency circulatory access. It is a rapid and safe method to establish vascular access in critically ill or injured patient when peripheral or central venous access is difficult or delayed. Whenever it is an emergency to administer fluid or medication in a very sick child, after two peripheral cannulation attempt failure, one should go for intraosseous access. The most common site being the upper end of tibia. After a short cleaning and draping, lignocaine may be infiltrated into and around the periosteum of that area. Periosteum is a sensitive tissue and injection or infiltration of lignocaine around this site will decrease the pain as far possible. However, pain is not of much importance here as it is a life-saving procedure. Then keeping the equipment here, intraosseous needle in the middle with the drill machine and connectors on both sides. After assembling the intraosseous needle to drill machine, it is time to fix the bony point with one hand and to insert the needle with other hand. Once needle is inside, a feeling of give away sensation is felt and the drill is disconnected. The needle is very fixed to bone already. Now it is time to push a saline fluid bolus through the needle to check for patency. Once patency is confirmed, the needle is fixed with a tape and the connector is attached through which now fluid or medication can be given. On a special note, it's an uncommon procedure and for short stay only, as infection, if happens at this place, can directly reach to the bone marrow.